ZL Entertainment. Greetings, boys and girls. I'm Jack Dion from ZL Entertainment, and today we're here for another episode. Episode, what, 13, was it? Yep. We're on episode 13 of Code Tour 2. Um, so let's quickly get through this crap again. Please. Uh, what do you mean? Think about it. And let's talk to this douche again. You have the. Uh. Who's she? I'll be going now. So. I'll be going now. I don't want to talk to you, fucktard. All right, let's go click on this bullshit thing. No, stop. What the fuck is going on? This game fucking sucks sometimes. Like all the goddamn time. Talk to this douchebag. Please tell. Yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, let's sell our shit. If we have anything, I don't think we have anything. All right. There must come. This bullshit. Uh, they definitely have something. These are dangerous times. All right. People like Panla aren't making it. She doesn't want to talk to us. Car, wanna... Blah, 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 blah. What do you think of her? What do you think of him? There would be deep consequences. Who do you trust more? Don't. I think... From what I've heard, she seems all right for a surprising change. And, uh, obviously we can't go that way. So, here I'm gonna just randomly save it again. There, that was quick, right? It was only three minutes. Now let's do this shit again. Hopefully we can get it good and going. Blah, 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 blah. You. And then you. Yeah. Hey, just move the camera over that. Go with this guy now. Can you tell me that loser already died? Wow. What a shitty Mandalorian. Yeah, it's decent shape, that old crazy lady said, when we're the ones who's keeping him safe. Gonna need a couple of these yourself. How am I supposed to take all these guys out? Med packs are better than the healing. Kinda gotta do that nowadays. Oh, let's just heal right away. Two of them should do. And then you can do that. Looks 
like I'm here to save the day. As usual. Alright. Probably gonna end up using all our med packs, but whatever. I'll be keeping a huge supply of them from now on. I'm gonna have to use two after each one of these guys, aren't I? Or maybe I'll need to use two after killing two of these guys. Nope, that grenade really fucked me over. so he stops missing. Is it dexterity? Because I'll, I'll increase it next time I get a chance. In fact, maybe this level up will give me the chance. What's, what's the good of having all this strength if I can't land a hit? That guy's doing no damage at all. This is a very, very messy battle system. It's very horrible. Very, like... No, I feel like I'm playing a 3D version of an RPG Maker game. And if you guys played an RPG Maker game, you know how shit most of them are. You know what, my turn to do is try a grenade. At least that will do something. I bet there's something for both of us. Alright, time for the remains bounty. I expect more than that one. Okay, so four out of all those. That's just great. I'm glad I saved my uh, level ups so that they can, uh, you know, get their health back quickly. Alright. I'm gonna save after that. Huge, horrible mess. Yeah, I wanna level you up. And then... you. And then us. Great. Nope, can't upgrade our stuff. Went randomly quiet there. I'm guessing it is dexterity. Sure, go with that. I don't care. I would auto level my character up too, but they. For the skills, they don't do what I would want. No more remains. 
I didn't hardly get anything for all that crap. Thugs. Thugs and commoners. Salvager. This looks like a nice club. Ah, oh, that's for the cantina. That sounds good. Might go there. Dagon Kent's place. He's not the best doctor you'll ever meet, but he's well connected in this city. Doesn't look like he's here right now, though. You looking for Dagon? You're not gonna find him here. Where is he? The soldier captain was murdered at the cantina real good. They got some suspects at the tower. From what I hear, Dagon Kent is one of them. Uh, do you think he did it? He's certainly capable of it. And probably stupid enough to get caught. But we need him. Suspicion of murder or not. What tower? It's the turret tower on the other side of the market. Captain Riken is the man to talk to. Alright. If you talk to him, tell him I got his 20 credits. Alrighty. All the way over here for nothing. Well, let's, let's, let's at least go to the cantina. I really hate this planet. <laughs> I'll fight if somebody tries to fight me, but uh, that's where I'll leave it at. Gormo, what are you? What do you want? Uh, can I talk to you about this murder? Yeah, maybe, but probably not. Waitress. Patron. Hello. Um. Okay. <laughs> This place is so dumpy that they don't even have real girls here. They just have holograms. Man, what a shithole of a place. Hello, squid face. going now. I'm not going to do any of the stupid little mini games in this game. I never found them all that interesting. Yeah, you know about an extra star part, Lisa? Alright, well... Yeah, you got some of the super here. I suppose so. But yeah, they definitely seem like cops. Anything I can do to help? 
Alrighty then. And what about you? Were you one of the four? Okay, I'll be going. Hello. Por nada ni sopa maranga do risa vota. Go on and. Hmm. I'll be going. I don't like the general. Vix. I'll be going. I don't do races. Boring as hell. Oh, you were definitely one of them. Nice to meet you, sentient. Are you interested in a friendly game of Pazak? The deck is warm, the drink is plentiful, and... I'm talking about this right business, now. that is. Like most nights, I was here. Do you know him? <laughs> know him? He's probably my best friend on this planet. Honestly, he's not a very good doctor. But he is a great drinking companion. Alright. Latris, who are you? Just another patron? Yeah. Yeah, I can tell. I want to talk about this. Wait, what is your line of business? Oh, you don't know this guy. Yeah, that's an understatement. I'm a huge anti-authoritarian. Oh, yeah, that's an understatement. I'm a huge anti-authoritarian. Mungachino da imbrei wanachiki drumba bamboa conti chan mu. Do you know anything about him? Kawana bota yunta tanga kinamat. Something else. Uh, what do you know about the city? Mungachino da imbrei wanachiki drumba bamboa conti chan mu. What do you think of uh, these two people? That's what it sounds like. Alright, I'll be going. So he doesn't... Not many people seem to know much about this guy. What about you? There's got to be something you need. Something you want. I have connections, many connections in the city. I can provide high quality unique weapons that you won't be able to find elsewhere. I, would I like... even have a rare lightsaber crystal, something you'd never find elsewhere. If you need money, I'll pay you 5,000 credits. All I ah, ask this is, the girl. is get me one open starport visa. I want to talk about this for now. I really can't be any help with that. I might have been in the same detention cell that night that Dagon's in now. The soldiers were asking me some entertaining questions that night. I've got no... What were you doing? Let's just about? say I'm one of their usual suspects. Sort of comes with the territory. Yeah, what about this That's stuff? all I want to talk to you. You mentioned something about a lightsaber crystal? Many Jedi have fought on this world. One of them lost their lightsaber in the Beast Wars. A reliable source. I see that's grabbed your interest, eh? There's only one way you're going to get it. One op- I'll be going. I'm not gonna give you my only way off this hellhole just for a crappy, uh, thing. Did I talk to you yet? I thought it was you. I served in the Mandalorian. I don't remember you. I was one of the ground troops. We fought on Daggery Minor together. It was near the beginning of the war. We, uh, we didn't win that battle. That's ancient history. Enough of the past. The whole galaxy isn't safe for Jedi now. Especially here. Onderon has suffered through three wars started by fall. I'm out for myself now. The public is of no concern to me. A pity. The Republic needs every capable person they can get. If you'll excuse me. I want to talk to you if about the murder. Excuse me. What a complete dick. Too bad we can't start a fight or he would be the first to die. Alright, so we had talked to everybody here and they're all lame. 
really lame sauce. Uh, how boring. All right, well. I guess we're gonna go have to go back the way we came. More fighting, that's great. We saw more go to see Sheba Dente School and most of it get a Yavach. Bram Tabani Socho. The coma just mark me. You're threatening me. Prepare to die. Yatuka, who won Rika, Chotin, Wanim, Aurata Wakata. All right. Okay, you guys don't die this time so goddamn easily. No, you're not fighting him. We're all taking the same person on. Man, you guys really took him care of, if I can speak properly. No, don't do one of those stupid attacks. Let's go. Cancel. Alright. This is going much better than before. Alright. Cancel and attack. Cancel and attack. Cancel and attack. No. Okay, good. Thought you were going to the other person. Alright. Cancel and attack. Action. Ah, stop getting rid of my med packs, game. And then... Make sure you go to the right person. Alright. Go to that person. Go to that person. And then you go to that person. Come on. Fight the right person. There we go. Cancel. Don't do that game. Cancel. And this guy. We're going after the guy who threatened us first. This will, in real life, this would just completely demoralize the person and frighten them to see all the people that they came here with completely gone. Ah, so these guys are called Aqua Lich. And... Oh my... You guys can do whatever you want. I'm now focusing... on him. Wow. How pathetic they were. They were a lot easier than the last ones. Ooh, credits. Ah, getting some of the goods. Nice. Getting so much credits that I'm definitely going to be buying a bunch of uh, med packs. 
Oh, I got a Starport Visa. I can give that to somebody. Should I give it to that one lady? Or should I give it to the other one? I'm gonna go and give it to this one so I can get that, uh, should I? Hmm. I could get money or I could get Jedi Crystal. I'll think about it. Hopefully there's time to do so. Sounds like gunshots going off in the game. Man, this is General, we have found them again. Have we, Tobin? Or is this a preface to another of your failures? Consider the whole field, Tobin. Why would a Jedi risk all of this just to come to Isis? I the crew of the why. Ebon Hawk is elusive, General. We were warned about that, but we still underestimated them. But the fools are here, in Isis. The intel on this is certain. I'm ordering men loyal to us to take care of them now. Hmm. I think I have an idea. Hold that order. Have him watched instead. The Jedi may prove a solution to another one of our persistent problems. Hmm. Don't like the sound of that. I'd rather have a an attack instead of spies. Because now I don't know who to trust. Don't trust anybody. That's my motto in life. Where was that cutscene taking place at? Hello, sir. You have returned! Yeah, I'm gonna be buying a lot of stuff from you. Alright, weapons. Nothing else new here. Any new armor that I can get rid of? That sounds nice, but... Oh, that's a light armor. I could use that. Um, what I have now is 5 defense and 5 dexterity, whereas... This is the same, but Alpha has damage immunity against bludgeoning, piercing, and flashing. Okay, we can sell this crap. I don't want medium. 10 and 1, 9 1, and 1 string. So I'll get rid of this. That's pretty crap. That's good. Good for poison, so I'll keep that. I'll keep this. I'll keep that for now. Sell that crap. I'll keep all these shields. They're good shields. Cardio regulator. <clears throat> that one looks like crap. That looks alright. I don't want that. I have a better version of that. Uh, we can get rid of that crap. That's a really good one. In fact, that might be better than the other one I had. No, that is the one I'm talking about. Okay. So yeah, that's better than the other stealth unit. Um, one strength. That's kind of lame. These are droid parts. I'll get rid of excess. Alright. That was armor, right? Yeah, it's a misc. Uh, these are not worth a lot. But I'm thinking on selling all of them and just buying advanced. Yeah, so from now on I'm gonna only get advanced med packs. I'm gonna get as much as I can. 
You can have that crap and that crap. So this dexterity, that might be good for me until I get better dexterity. Wait, let's finish off. Okay, it doesn't talk about anything else. Uh, stamina adds constitution, basically. These are all good, then. Um, this is dexterity, okay. Alright, show the buy list now. I'll take these and all of the advanced. And you do not have a lot of stuff. And parts, that's very expensive. So I'll be going now. Was this where they were doing that cutscene? Or over there? Can't really tell. I'm Captain Galisi, Offworlder. If you want to pass here, I'll need to see. Everything seems in order. Somewhere's around here, one of these towers, I think it's one of these, it said something about the shooting towers, but maybe we get to it from the merchant's area. Maybe it's actually that one place we weren't able to go to before. Wait, did you have a name? Ah, you did. Welcome to what must be the smelliest place in the... We certainly do. He and... Captain Sulio. She was in charge of the Starport Checkpoint. A good soldier. So far, he's just a suspect. But if Dagon Kent is the only person I know with the contacts to help us out. Until we either eliminate him as a suspect or find the real killer. Dagon has quite a record with the authorities. I know Dagon personally. He's one of the worst doctors I've ever heard of. But I can't see him deliberately killing someone. Yeah. He was one of the last people seen with Captain Sulio in the cantina. Ask around there. I've heard he's got a good motive for killing her. If you can somehow clear that up and prove it wasn't him... Stay out. I mean, I already did ask people, but let's... Back again. Um, I guess I have to ask them again? That's stupid. Alright. Well... It must be like to the royal palace or something. Um. Yeah. Guess we just really go back and talk to these people again. Pretty lame sauce. quickly just to see oh so that's why we have to do that okay I got one, and I kind of have a difficult decision. Do I want her to give me 5,000 or the crystal? Like, if I could know what the crystal was good for, I would probably get the crystal. 
But 5,000 is really good that you go a long ways to getting me, you know, a lot this of This room is reserved off. Huh. If you ask me, she got what she deserved. She looked down on us beast riders. Good riddance. Do you know this person? I know his face. That's about it. His office. Who is Bakel? She's a beast rider like me and our leader. You better never be speaking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what? If, why would he do Flaming this? Flaming right, I do. The night she made the great flight, she ripped Dagon apart. Not literally, but we could hear her lay. We got a good laugh at it. Dagon was so mad he was sputtering. Then he stormed off. Bet. All right. So, people are going to be talking to me a bit more now, I suppose. Uh, I'll do that later. Do you know him? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll, go. I'll be going now. I don't want to actually do that. Do you have a visa? I want to talk to you about this. I really can't be any. Um. If you'll excuse me. You. Welcome back. She did? Oh no, by the four moons, what a mix-up. They got it all wrong. Dagon and Sulio were good friends. It's just when they got a little too much Juma juice, they'd carry on. They'd call each other all manner of things. It could get quite hilarious, really. But it was just friendly banter. Mm. That night, Celia was in great form. Dagon and I were laughing about some of the choicer ones later. Yellow Tooth Dung Dweller. <laughs> We bought her a couple of drinks afterwards. It may look strange on the outside, but it was just their habit, their way of passing time during these dark nights. Listen, if the soldiers think that's a motive, they just didn't do enough digging. That bit of information will help with clearing Dagon, but the Andoran military won't let him off that easy. They're very obstinate. Maybe some of these people will know more about what happened that night. Uh, what happened on the night of the murder? I was cleaning up stakes from a particularly rewarding Pazak game when I heard a loud sound outside. I grabbed my blaster and went out the door. When I got out, I saw Captain Salio. She was quite dead. Blood was everywhere. I heard a noise and saw Dagon Ghent coming from his office across the courtyard. We both waited for the authorities to get there. The next day, they picked up Dagon and several other people in the area. It's crazy to think he did it. Salio was our friend. Hmm. Where do you find the body? Just outside the door by the junk heap. It might be a good idea to look at the crime scene. True. We fought many soldiers in the Mandalorian Wars. The Andoronians were certainly brave, but they were disorganized and stupid. I wouldn't be surprised if they overlooked something. Uh, know him. Okay, I'm going. I'm gonna... Ask this guy something. <laughs> Alright. Do you know him? Well, I guess. I guess there's not much else I can talk to about this. Maybe we already got all we need to know. I guess uh, we'll just go out here and check this heap pile or is it this one or is it really this one there is blood here there's a broken joy Nobody we talked with mentioned a droid. 
This droid was destroyed recently. This Someone like, inside the, the cantina might This was one of the first things I looked at when I came into this area. It's kind of funny. See, this is kind of cool, actually. I, I kind of like the whole murder mystery solving type thing. I'm sure somebody helping in the developing of the game was like, you know, a murder mystery would be pretty cool. Welcome back. Uh, actually, I'm gonna talk to the bartender. He might know more. What keeps happening to your serving droids? Why didn't you mention this before? Alrighty. I'm starting to think it's Nico. Welcome back. My deck is still warm if you're up for... Foul business, that is. That would be Bohemia's SOD2. Uh, no. SOD3. Or is it two? Whichever one it was, he keeps losing them. I remember when I arrived, it was still smoldering. What happened to it? Who knows? Sometimes the slum dwellers shoot his serving droids for fun. This part of the quarter is getting more and more lawless, I'm afraid. When Dagon and I were waiting for the soldiers, we had to chase off some scavengers that were stripping SOD3. Do you remember who scavenged the droid? No, I'm afraid there was quite a crowd growing. We were seeing if there was any way we could help Sullio. There was nothing we could do, of course. She was dead. Hmm. Mm, might be the bartender. Um. They don't seem warmongering, they're just retarded. Yeah, the whole galaxy was at war. Why do you think you'd be spared? Yeah, you're safer now. I'm not coming back to you, you stupid cunt. Uh, let me talk to the waitress. I think she might know something. Now, what do you order? I'll just guess. I guess not. Alright, what do we do now? That's it? I had to go talk to somebody here? Oh wait. This guy. This room is reserved. I haven't talked to him in a while. <laughs> if you ask me. That Bith keeps buying droids, and the scavengers keep stealing them or blowing them up. Seems he's finally given up. The waitress is awful, but she's more fun than his droids ever were. I guess. Any days who's scavenging? I wouldn't tell you even if I knew. I could tell you where you could find the parts, though. Where? That western square has the perfect fence for droid parts. There is a droid vendor called 1B8D. That droid is as dumb as a Gamorian. 1B8D is quite handy. Quite a few of the slum dwellers make a good living salvaging droid parts for him. You might have even bought some. Alright, I'll be going now. Alright, so 
so we gotta find a droid. This must be the one. I am 1BAD, an automated droid vendor. I have in stock a variety of quality droid components, no refunds, and no haggling. Do you have any interest in my goods? Uh, let me see if I can wire you to be more helpful. Reinitializing complete. Greetings. Do you have any interest in my goods? You can give me commodities for free. I don't care about that. I need to know if you have any parts from one of Bahima's serving droids. Entity Bahima unknown. I have many serving droid parts. The market rate for those parts. Thank you for... Kiff in the cantina can probably do something with this. We should head back. All right. Am I able to get Greetings, those three master. parts, though? That goes against my pro- <laughs> Request access market conditions. Change all multiply by zero. Market conditions all set to zero. All prices now set to base cost value. I wonder if that actually worked. I don't know. They look, still look expensive. Alright. Well, um, that was weird. Let's see, who do we have to talk to? Was it this guy? Yes. Do need some man. The one to more chiwa. Yeah, can you get any information from it, please? Bahupa, bossa, urata, go, juju to yoki, hiata yamba wajiaki, yuki to tune. All right. Kawana botai. Hello there. What is this? Oh my, she's dead. Kawana botai, yunta tanga kinamatura. Alrighty. Welcome back. My Foul business that if it'll help, there's no way that Dagon could have done it. I saw him coming from his office. That's the opposite direction of the marketplace. Awesome. That uh that's pretty cool. Nico is it? And the off-worlder. All right, he couldn't have killed him. That's a bold statement. I assume you have some sort of proof. Been doing work. It's a long story, so bear with me, Captain. The night of the murder, I was playing Pazak. It was a prosperous night. That should do it. We still don't know who killed Sulio, but this will greatly assist our investigation. You have been ordered off this investigation, Captain. I hope you can explain. I had nothing to do with this, sir. This citizen found information about Captain Sulio's murder. It's material to the investigation. We've already got our man. Sulio and this Ghent were fighting the night she was murdered. Yeah, how much investigating did you actually do? We did our job, Offworlder. In an hour or two of... Have you read the report? Did you talk to anybody in the bar? Why, you little... Friends would not carry on in such a manner. It's absolutely true, Major. I was a friend of both of them. They've done this dozens of times. Bahima, the bartender, can confirm it, as well as half a dozen other people. They were an odd pair, but they certainly didn't hate each other. I see. Well, there's still the fact that he was right there at the scene of the crime. I mean, he lives there. So were other people. Some salvagers were stripping the serving droid there with a minute or two. So what? What matters is who was there first. An eyewitness said he... The only thing that matters to me is that he was within blaster range when Sulio was killed. Yep. 
recording shows the promoter coming from somewhere from the opposite direction where he uh, lived. You have a recording? Well, I'm sure you're just misinterpreted. I've seen it myself, Major. Nico isn't the only one that spotted Dagon coming from his office. It really can't be Dagon Gen. Very well, Captain. Set Gen free, then. But if later it turns out that he did do it, it's gonna be on your head. He didn't do it, old geezer. The men will be working on getting Dagon Gen out right away. <laughs> the Major's... Great job, Nico. Without you, I'm pretty sure that the Doctor would still be behind bars. What were you trying to do, Offworlder? If I hadn't spoken up for Dagon, he'd still be in jail. And he seemed pretty unwilling to believe. And what are you talking about? I helped him get free, you fucktard. The investigation has been handled at the highest levels. I've heard there's been some concern about that. With Dagon free, I don't know if the investigation team will find another suspect. They haven't been as diligent as other investigators. What do you mean? I'm not gonna say anymore. Probably said too much already. If you head over to Dagon Gent's office, some men will bring him there shortly. Thanks for clearing this whole thing up. I could tell the justice wasn't being served, but we all have our orders. They really need to patrol that sector better. Yeah, at least some people kind of care. Thanks for getting me out of there. As detention cells go, it had definite class, but I prefer being out of my own all the same. I owe you and Mandalore one. Uh, what were you locked up in the first... We, we just spent like 20 or 30 minutes going through that, so... Uh, how do you know Mandalore? Let's be somewhat friendly. We go way back. Way before he became Mandalore. In my experience, Mandalorians always know about the doctors around. For some strange reason, they keep getting into scrapes. If you want to know more, ask him yourself. Makes sense. Place is a mess. I'm surprised nobody looted it. Yeah, it was. Although it looked pretty much like this to begin with. Thought a doctor's office would be more sterile. A little dirt never killed anyone. Well, maybe a few people. But they didn't pay too well, so they got what they deserve. I give my customers a menu of options. If they go for the deluxe, I'll clean up the place and put on a new smock. Otherwise, they knew the risks. Don't you call them patients? Patients, customers, idiotic huts, spawn, call them what you like. Most doctors tell you that they get into the business to save lives. Most of them are flaming liars. That's At least true. I'll tell you the truth. I'm in it for the credits. Okay, I, I can I can respect that. At least you're telling the truth, because that's literally the only reason why any doctor is doing what they're doing. There might be one doctor out there who actually cares, but I don't. I don't like believe what. It. Yeah, I've been told you could help me. Not many people can help you out with that. There've been several assassination attempts on Queen Talia. That place is locked tighter than a hut's fall. I like the idea of saying the phrase touch with. locked tighter than a nun's ass, but you know, whatever. Uh, who's trying to kill her? Nobody knows for sure, but everybody thinks that General Vaku has to have something to do with it. Yeah, I, I wouldn't it doubt it. It's quiet, but that place is locked down tight. Apparently I'm trying to, uh talk to a Jedi Master. A Jedi Master, you say? Now that is interesting. It's quite a bounty in Jedi these days. Not that I'm looking to collect, but if there's a Master there, I think I know who it is. I think I do too. It's probably that guy that was in the cutscene. Who do you think I'm it is? I'm not certain. Otherwise, i tell you. But the man I'm thinking about is smart, likes to stay in the shadows, and is cryptic as hell. If he isn't a Jedi Master, he should become one. Can you get touched with somebody inside the place? There's a slight problem with that. I know you don't want to hear that since it's, you went through it a video game. Out. I'm using thing is, stuff. scavengers have already looted most of my stuff. Most of it's garbage anyway, so I don't care too much. But I did have a couple of encrypted holodiscs that they nabbed. So here's the punchline. I need those discs because they have some contact information on them. People I know you don't just walk up and chat with. There's a procedure, and that holodisc has the procedure. Mm. We're going over time. 
but uh, let's talk. Look, the Kells gang pretty much owns this street. From what I hear, she's the one that cleaned me out. She's in the local cantina most days. She's tough as Drexel leather and more dangerous than an angry Wookiee. You take Mandalore with you, though, you should be just fine. Just get me the encrypted all of this. After that, if there is a Jedi Master in the palace, I'll get you a meeting with him. All right. Well, did I just get a lightsaber? A double one. I don't want it, but maybe I'll get it to the old lady. Wait, did he just like change his weapon? No, he got rid of his other sword. That's weird. Um. Oh yeah, I was gonna. I was gonna change my armor. This is good all in all, 5-5, five, five, but this also gives me this, so I'm going to give that to me. And this guy can have this. And... That's stupid. Um, I'm going to give him a Mandalorian shield since he is one. And then I'm going to give him an Arcanian because... Uh, I want to piss him off. Uh, still, no. Let's give him that. Alright, so... Um, I'm going to loot this place. Oh, we got a Sith battle suit now. Dead body. This is a pretty big old shit bowl. Alright. Well, next time we're gonna go over to the cantina and talk to that one lady. I'm also thinking on giving her my card to get money. I'm not sure. I think I'm gonna save it. Get the um, crystal. See if it's good at all. If it is, then I'll keep it. If it's not, then I'm gonna reload and then I'm going to take the 5k credits instead um so yeah that's that's that anyway i hope you guys all enjoyed love you all peace to you and as always stay safe